red arrives again. I picked the colour up and thought I haven't used that for a long time. I think I only used it two days ago. Well, actually, I could have just used it yesterday. It's possible. <laughs> just forget what you do. Do it and move on. Funny, isn't it? I think I'm going to put a very... I'm going to leave that quite undone like that. and white. The other half is going to be white. Very clean. The top will have to come off. There we go. And of course, being white, you get a tiny little bit of red in it and it will show. So being careful, so yeah, a little bit there, streak left on the knife. And yeah, that's quite a, it's quite a jaggedy line, isn't it? Let's get a bit more white out. Yeah, that is very jaggedy, isn't it? I'm concentrating. Oh. Obviously not enough. Oh, yeah, that is quite a lot of concentration, that. <laughs> Ooh, don't want, don't want that in there. Ooh. Just let the paint flow at the end. Little bit more, whoops, that's too much. It's a little bit more, still too much. A little bit more, that's about it. See if I can just, no, nope, didn't quite work. Whoops, whoops, it's getting messy. Hang on, abandon that. That's gonna, I'll have to get a new, new tool to do that with. Okay, we'll start again. Smooth it over. Done. That's it. Go. Yeah, that was a lot harder than I expected. Where's that? I need to use quite a bit of uh, quite a few knives in that. I'm going to do something I've done recently as well, is to just use the same two colours on the whole painting. Put that on there. A bit more. A 
and the red on the tip which is there and it's going to go like this.